Hi, my name is Alisa Bradley. I'm an assistive technology specialist working for both the National ALS Association and the Greater Philadelphia Chapter. Welcome to our ADD series, Assistive Device Demonstration. And today we're going to be talking about laser pointers and how they can be used for communication. This is an ideal device for people that um, might be living in a nursing home or that are enrolled in hospice or um, are not tech savvy or simply want something quick and easy to communicate with. Low Tech Solutions sells these products. You will see a link at the end of this video. And you can use a laser pointer um, either on your hand or on your head. This is the one that I have on my head. Should you not be able to get one of these or you need something immediately, you can go to a Five Below, a Walmart, even a dollar store, grab a laser pointer. And those laser pointers are going to have um, a little button to hold down. A piece of popsicle stick and duct tape will put that button down and then you can just apply it to a pair of glasses or even a baseball hat. If you um, don't wear glasses but want to put it on a pair of glasses, go to the dollar store, pop out the lenses, and then you just have a, a pair of frames and then you can put it right on the frame. So you don't need to spend a lot of money, now this is about $129, but you don't need to spend a lot of money in order to utilize a laser pointer. Also, these are great backup systems. Um, if you already have a very expensive communication device, you know, power can go out, things can break. Um, so a laser pointer is an ideal solution. Um, so what you want to do is I'm just going to attach it to my glass frame here. Okay, and then I'm going to turn it on, and the laser pointer oops, is just, I just go to the, the word I, or the letter that I want, or the word I want. Now, I'm using a very small letter board here. You can make your own. Go and buy a piece of poster board for 70 cents. You can make your own here. Um, Low Tech Solution also sells much larger ones. They're poster board size or even larger. So they can actually take up half the wall if you want. But again, you don't need to order through there if you want to make your own. Now, I just use the whiteboard here and just put some things that I want to say. And all I have to do is put my laser pointer there and people can read along with what I'm saying. And here, um, one of uh, the tenets that I teach all the time is that if you have yes and no, you need to have a maybe. Um, you don't just want to answer yes and no or ask yes and no questions because if you ask the question wrong, you're forcing the person to answer incorrectly. So it's always yes, no, maybe, which is why I have this here. Um, but inevitably, you put it up here and then I could spell my name A L I S A. Simple as that, and it doesn't take a lot of head movement. So I want to thank you for joining us for our assistive uh, device demo, our ADD of the day. And um, if you want to contact me, you can uh, contact me through Alisa, A-L-I-S-A, at alsphiladelphia.org. You can look this up at Low Tech Solutions. Um, this is not a covered item under insurance. Um, so ask your local chapter, maybe they have one, or make your own if you have to. Thank you.